do you get to keep the right to your work when you sell your uh, designs let's say repeat pattern designs textile designs online uh, let's find out in this video hello hello my amazing creative friends Oxanza here again I am a textile designer with more than 13 years of experience licensing my vector repeat pattern designs uh, directly to customers and selling them online on various websites so I have experience with that at the same time I am not a lawyer so uh, please do not take, take this as a legal advice take this as an information to go and read more and find out and contact a lawyer and ask them the final questions so that you can find out for yourself uh, the answer to your question do you get to keep the rights to your work is yes you are the creator of your work even if you don't register your work in any particular in uh, any particular organization uh, you created your work you get to keep the rights to your work. You are the author to those rights. When you sell your artwork or designs on various websites online, you enter in a contract with those websites. So it's very important to uh, figure out which contract you are signing when you uh, become a contributor on those websites. And at the same time, uh, what happens usually, let's say on Microstock websites such as Shutterstock or Adobe Stock, uh, what happens is that they act as as an intermediary between you as a creator and the clients who want to license artwork for their businesses for various purposes for uh, uh, personal purposes or commercial purposes so what happens is that there is a license that is created between you and those clients and at the same time the website that acts on your behalf is uh, providing that uh, license to your clients but the website doesn't keep the license to your uh, work doesn't keep the rights to your work you get to keep those rights there is another important thing to remember however is that you can uh, sell exclusive rights to your work or you can sell non-exclusive rights to your work to your artwork uh, and what happens is that if you sell exclusive rights, it means that you create an artwork for a particular customer uh, only and only they will get to use that artwork that you created. You will not license any rights to that artwork to anyone else. This is sometimes possible with Microstock websites, but normally you uh, license uh, to multiple, 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 many people and with a few different types of licenses there. For example, personal and regular license or commercial use license. I know it might be confusing in the beginning, but basically just keep in mind that you do keep the rights to your artwork when you create your work, when you sell your work as well. And unfortunately, people tend to uh, get in trouble sometimes because people steal other people's work. This is internet. This thing, things happen. Do not let those fears steer you away from creating and being able to uh, license your artwork and make income with your work. This is my position on this matter do not get scared by those things unfortunately just keep in mind these things happen and even if you particularly do everything right is this thing can still happen it's just like uh, anything else in life at the same time you get to keep your uh, rights to your work and you can license them again to other clients and other people automatically via the website or personally that they get in contact with you and you license that way uh, please keep in mind that if you license your uh, pattern to a customer exclusively, it means that you only created that pattern for them, please have a contract in place. At the same time, please make sure that you do not license to other people, uh, other clients. Uh, sometimes it might be that they are only exclusive for one year, two years, six months. Then after that, you get to license to uh, other clients. So there are all kinds of different contracts in situations. Please talk to a lawyer if you want to find out more in depth about that. And I recommend also studying up on this topic because it's a very interesting topic to know as a an artist licensing your work online.
All right, you guys, I hope you found this video helpful. If you want to know how to grow your repeat pattern design uh, portfolio faster, I have an awesome free bonus uh, workbook for you. Please check it out in the info card in this video uh, or in the description uh, under this video and you will be able to start creating and growing your repeat pattern portfolio much, much faster using my system and at the same time i hope you like this video if you liked it share this video with other creative friends and uh, subscribe to stay tuned to the pattern vibe uh, i love you guys catch you in my next video <laughs>